<laughs> All right, let's talk about the movie Precious for a minute because, um, okay, uh, you know, a couple of things about that film. First of all, I thought it was a great movie, and I, I really did. Uh, I can't say that I enjoyed it because it was not that kind of movie that you enjoy, like Chicago. Right. You know, it's not that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's a ton of Oscar that. buzz, and we're very happy. Do you think Monique? First of all, do you think Monique is going to win the uh, supporting actress? I think she should. I really do think she you should. Do. I thought her performance. I do. I think her performance was amazing and it was brutal and devastating and I think she really brought that character to the screen as authentically as it could be played yeah um, and uh, you know I really think she did a, a, an amazing job with it I, I honestly can't see anybody else getting it but you, you never know with the Oscars you never know who's gonna actually get it once those once that uh envelope is open so that's true but I, I hope she does i, I hope, really she, hope does she does too because she never really tried to make herself likable you know how actresses always have right. to some likableness she really didn't go right. for it it was really authentic because yeah. she was a monster and then you, right and you're hearing like about oh this one didn't want to wear makeup and this one wore makeup but you know none of that to me that's the sign of a, a really true great actor when you're not afraid to be ugly you're not afraid to be a villain when you really play that if you're the villain, be the villain. You know, if you're the good guy, be the good guy. Right. You know, don't try to have a little bad guy in your good guy. You know what I mean? And so, to me, she played it so true to what that character demanded, um, and you believed it. I yes. mean, that's what you want when you go to the movies. You don't want to say, hey, I'm watching Queen Latifah. I'm watching Monique. I'm, you're watching that character that you sold it so well that people are not watching whoever you are in real life. They're really watching that that movie and those characters, and they're caught up in the story. So yes. I think they did a, you know, Lee Daniels did a great job, you know, telling that very difficult story and even telling it with some some humor and some light moments, you know. So I think everybody thought Precious was just down, 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 but Which, there are actually some pretty funny moments in there. Yes, and, you know, it's an interesting thing. It's, it's, it's about the, the African-American community, and a lot of people have criticized that particular point. But I... Re remember hearing Lee Daniels saying that th uh, th that it was done in London with an all white cast. I thought that was <laughs> yeah. fascinating because because bad people are everywhere. Good people and yeah, bad I people. don't really see, yeah. exactly. I don't really see this as a black. I mean, it's, 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 it's it happens in Harlem. You know, there are black people in the movie, but this story happens across the board. It doesn't matter what race you are. And this story can be told in many different places by many different people. Of course. So I, I agree with him on that.